Hi everyone! Today we are going to see how you can check the utilization of your resources using Activity Timeline. One of the most popular Activity Timeline reports is a resource utilization report. User can generate this report very quickly. Just select the needed teams or individuals, choose dates, apply Jira filters if needed, and generate a web report. Here we can see a combined workload of the team and users for a month, their total available capacity, which is based on the user's working hours, but also takes into consideration all the holidays, vacations, and other non-working days. We can also see utilized capacity in hours, a planned time which is based on the remaining estimates of the tasks assigned to the user, as well as bookings and placeholders created in Activity Timeline. We can also understand what is the rate of the resource utilization. Let's see what each of the colors mean. The gray color shows us that the user has no workload per day, usually it equals weekends. If you see white cells, you can understand that the user has no workload but has available capacity, so he can take some more tasks. The yellow color means that the person has low workload and is also available for more working hours. A slight green shows us that the person is slightly underloaded and green cells that the workload is just perfect. The red color shows that the user is overloaded. In our case, we can clearly see that the same user is underutilized for one week and overutilized for another week, so we can simply redistribute workloads to make the user's workload balanced. As we previously mentioned, Activity Timeline supports holidays management, so non-working days are included in the reports. Here we can see the cells with a blue color, which means that the user has a vacation or a sick leave or days off that are counted as a non-working days, so user doesn't have available capacity for this period, and this is included in the report. Users can also switch between days, weeks or months. Additionally, you can drill this data down by either project, epic or even initiative to see where the resources are allocated. It is also possible to export a report like an Excel file. Here you can see how it looks. Simply bookmark your report for quick access, make them private or share them with the team members. To get some more tips on Jira resource management and time tracking, check our more informative videos on this channel. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out to our support at support.relikes.com. See you in our next episodes.